Greetings everybody, welcome back to Lunacid. The real question is, what are we doing today? Uh, hello Demi, how are you doing? Thank you. Uh, what are we doing today? Do we have any weapons to level up? I don't think we do. Oh yeah, the Shining Blade. We, ha we now have the Shining Blade, which is great. Great! Because um, we finally have a great holy weapon. Feels good, man. <laughs> so... What we're gonna do now is that we're gonna explore the Fallon Arena. Like, once again. Huh, there's an axe on that side. I think there's a sword on this side, right? Yep. Is there anything over here then? Uh, a strange structure. Hmm. Oh, I think my game is a bit too loud. Okay, now it's better. Okay, so there's this side, and there's the dark side. Wait, we were on the light side last time, but when we were on the light side, we found the dark sword, which turned into the light sword. And then there's the both sides, okay. I think I see one of those creatures there. What were their weaknesses again? Wait, what? Did he move? Oh, he did. Oh, he... Yeah, they were... They are weak against light. So, if I take the... Oh. Fuck, I may be stupid. I shouldn't invent her. Did this break his tail? Whoa! Okay, they are weak to light. So, I should use my... Uh... Shining blade against them. I mean, it does even do more damage. Look at that. That's great. Only bad thing about it that that it doesn't train. Yeah. Meet you with that light attack. Okay, I shouldn't be this careless. Oh, this is blocked by a seal. It is sealed, I see. Wait, I wonder if I was supposed to activate something on the light side, but I didn't. Oh man, the music is spooky. I mean, I did do, I did do things on the light side, but... Interesting. I wonder if I if there was something I didn't do in the light side. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go back here and heal, and then I'll head to the other side. I'm guessing there's gonna be more of those uh, lizard creatures there, right? Probably. Hello, any lizards out here? Yeah. So they think. Honestly, they don't take that much extra light damage. So I think I'll go back to Blade of Ophelia. Because the healing is just amazing. Oh, oh there's another lizard so don't I have what what was the one thing the halberd no but yeah the black flail is also really good it does over 100 damage I wonder if I should start using it but then again blade of Ophelia heals which is fucking amazing just having a passive heal is really strong in any 
game where you have to dungeon crawl. I really hope I didn't miss anything on the light side. Ah, fuck. Get fucked. Whew. Oh, I didn't jump. Didn't jump right. Whew. This guy is dead. Yeah. Whoa. Also, I wanted to try out the lands. Where's the lands again? Um. The halberd. Where's the funny? Where's the funny? I think it was steel. Yeah. The steel lands. Wait, I wonder if I can use this to dash in the air over this thing. No. It only works on the ground. Anyways, I think I can just make this jump. Okay, I cannot. I have to use the rock bridge, it seems. Right? I don't think I'm... Oop! Oh, never mind, I'm good. Where's that? Okay, nothing there. Do, 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 do. Oh, this is a banger. Anyways, let's get Blade of Ophelia back. Look for any hidden walls ahead. Oh, hey, there's more of these plants here. That's great. So this is the light area, eh? Is that water dangerous? No, it doesn't appear to be. Oh, hey, who this? Vesta, health, fire, no. Vesta. No, what it does. Suspicious. That's not a wester. Okay, let's check the walls for any hidden walls. <sighs> Man, I'm a bit tired, eh? I wish I wasn't so tired. Ugh. Can't hear me. 
Did this have, have any like weakness? Why can't I hit them? Yeah, fire weakness. Like normal. Really basic. <laughs> Moonlight's light's kinda hard to see in this place. So called light dungeon, yet it's dark here. What do you mean by that? What's in here? Another Vesta? I'm curious what they can do. Just walking. Destroying Angel? Okay. Another Vesta? Really not doing anything, eh? Hey, there's some darkness in this bond, right? Wasn't the... Wasn't the sign of darkness the... Uh, sword? Oh hey, there's an item here too. Fairy moss. Great! I love fairy moss. I think I might be a little bit lost here. I came from here, right? Yeah, okay. I think I checked these walls already, huh? Okay, let's look for any hidden walls. That leads somewhere up. Okie dokie. Let's go get that potion. Okay, no hidden walls ahead. That's good. Honestly, starting to feel like I should just be shooting my spells at random walls just to make sure that they're not <laughs> some magically uh, activated things because we had so many of those in the manor and other places, so there could be more magical activation in this game. Oh boy. There is No, there's not the Vesta here. Oh boy. <sighs> Still no hidden walls ahead. Where does this lead? Let go somewhere down. Do you wanna jump down? Uh Seems a bit sus. I don't know if I want to jump down. There's an item there. Let's remember this, that we can jump down here. No hidden walls. No hidden walls, okay. Vestas, perhaps. Nope. No Vestas here. We do have a Dillon Sia here. Bye bye. Oh, read? Oh, a note. They appear to die when dealt enough blows, but I'm not so sure. There has clearly been a sharing of blood between them and Sukkareos, and the unkilling curse, like the reptile, regrows lost limbs. They are his and grow as such. Okay, so the reptiles grow things. Uh, hidden walls. Wait, what? What's here? I think I wonder if that's an error of some sort. No, oh, can't walk there either. Oh, that's strange. Perhaps a bug? I don't know. Health while. Okay, so Vesta seem to have a close range poison attack. When I was close to it, it shook and uh, shot 
poison around it. So that seems to be their attack, eh? Interesting. Now what's in here? Any hidden walls? No, nothing here. Nothing here. Probably gonna find Vestas in here. Wait, is this the start? Ah, we have gone in a circle. So... Okay. I'm just gonna take a quick trip around this part and see if we missed anything. I don't believe that we missed anything. Yep, everything looks okay. So, I'm guessing that we now have to jump down the big hole. Correct? This big hole. I haven't seen anything else here. Ouch. Maybe I should have uh, done something to ease the fall, but, well, no can do. At least we didn't take that much fall damage, though. Now I wonder what's down here, then. Let's deal with the enemies first before we look for any hidden walls. Take care of this Vesta. Any other Vestas here? Nope. Okie dokie. Now check for hidden walls. Doo -doo -doo. No hidden walls. Okie dokie. Oh hey. Celes. Oh, we saw one of you before. Low to see the pod. Hmm. Left or right? Okay. That looks like that. Let's see. Wonder what's here then. Another Celeste. Oops, I missed. Okay. Celeste down. Any. Uh, ah, here's one. Antidote. That's it. Antidotes. Okay. Well, I mean, it's better than nothing. It's good to have antidotes. Even though... I'm pretty sure my uh, holy water will just... Let me read the holy water. Cure all elements. Wait, my lunacy is at 58%. Oh, this is scary. Does it increase every time I shoot this? I don't know. Ooh, what does lunacy do? I have a high lunacy. I hope. Okay. I wonder what. Does. Wait. Oh, every time I cast speed, I. Oh, what's what's the? Oh, a trap. Oh. Okay. Every time I cast my speed, I gain lunacy. <laughs> what does it do? I'm scared. Those, those fellas are traps. They seem to shoot at an angle in front of them. So let's be careful about them. Also, I'm not gonna be casting my speed because I don't want any more lunacy. I find it concerning that my lunacy is rising. Because I don't know what it does. What if I die if it reaches too high? Wait, what if I drink holy water? Does it cleanse lunacy? No. Damn it. Oh, hidden wall? Great. There's an item at the end. Okay, well, we're gonna take it a bit slow since we're not 
leveling, leveling our uh, lunacy. Oh, another blade. Obsidian seal. Obsidian seal. A fragile tin blade of obsidian with a strange seal trapped within. Just dark damage. Okay. Interesting. We're gonna look into that more, but a bit later. These plants don't really take much dark damage, so I'd say it's a bit pointless to level it, level it up now. Then again, why not level it? I can use it for the little plants around, right? Okay. Let's walk back. I can use it for these plants. Okay. So this is like the opposite of the light blade, I think. So for this, nice and nice. Wait, was there another path? Oh. I almost got hit there. Okay, no, there was not another path here. Let's head forward and see what's in here. You know what, maybe we can try fight, fighting a plan with this. Ah, damn it. How long this poison will last? Oh, we get fairy moss in here. That's great. Well, that poison didn't last long. That's nice. Oh, health vials. Great. <laughs> okay, okay. There appears to be nothing here. Oh, another vista. Do, do, do. Oh, Celeste. Oh, be careful, that's a strong beam. I need to be careful here. Do, do, do. Oh, yeah, I gotta remember about lunacy. Hmm, I wonder if this will lead back to the start then. Well, not yet. Uh, another water section. Yeah, yeah, shoot your thing. Ouch. I gotta be a bit more careful. Oh! It can gas things up as well, it seems. I know this will take a long time to kill this creature, but we can level up this blade like this, right? Oh. Wait. Does hitting things level blades up? I wonder if that was a waste of time after all. Let's just do this. My lunacy is reaching higher and higher. I need to be really careful here to not do anything stupid. I'm gonna keep a close eye on my lunacy. Let's see what happens with it. I'm not gonna go to a hundred percent with it, at least not before I save. I think I will uh, 
When I reach a save, I will try to get my lunacy to 100. I think that's the fun thing to do. I'll save the game and then I'll get 100 lunacy and see what it does. Yeah, that sounds fun. Anyways, let's get some speed to explore this area. So I think I should pop a health potion. There we go. This is a place. Oh, wisp hearts. Nice. Anything else here? No. Okie dokie. That something? No. The, my thing just. I just equipped the weapon which caused me to uh, see a text. Let's keep going forward. Also, didn't I uh, receive something at the end of that one dungeon? I don't remember what spell it was, but I think I received a spell. Look at this. What was the spell that I received from the dark side? I cannot remember. Hmm, strange. Anything here? Nope. I'm not seeing any creatures. Oh, another one. Oh, an ocean elixir. That's perfect. I love an ocean elixir. Ocean elixir. There we go. Equip that. Drink it. Also, did we have an earth elixir from earlier? Or no? No, we don't. Okay, let's equip our uh, strange coins again. Almost got crushed by the wall. I wonder if that's possible. That would be scary. <laughs> Hello, plants. Let me kill you. <sighs> and where are we now, I wonder? Will this be the end? Nope, there's another plant there. Bonk, bonk, and bonk. Bye bye, Vesta. Do I see another plant over there? No, I don't. But I do see. A... What's this? It's not the starting area. It's something else. Something we haven't been in yet. Perhaps we were there, but I just don't remember. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? Are we fighting any hidden walls? No? Okay. Damn. Which is... Oh, there's one. What's this then? Hmm, there appears to be nothing here. At least, not yet. Anything at the end? No. What's the purpose of this place then? There's nothing here. What? Do I have to uh, rock bridge myself up there somewhere? There's a hole. I could probably rock bridge myself up there, right? Should I go here or should I? Okay. So there's a hidden place over there. There's also something here. So I think I wanna go here first. Also, I gotta I gotta save up on my lunacy points. Holy shit. I gotta re be really careful about that lunacy. Because if I have too much lunacy, I'm I, I'm still 
I'm guessing that Lunas is a bad thing, by the way. But if I have too much lunacy, then I cannot uh, go up there. Okay, anyways, let's check here. Another mimic? Yeah, great. Let's get a water talisman. Water talisman. There we go. A broken piece of a magical item. A river of death washed through the area. It slowly eroded and soon nothing remained save those who could not die and those that thrive from death. Did we get another talisman in the last episode? I can't... Yeah, oh, earth talisman. Yeah, this thing. A broken piece of a magical item. When the law of combat was... All that mattered, a grand arena was formed by the erosive movements of life. Ages of conflict would give it from, and then be broken. Yeah, I remember this. This was in the last episode. So now I have both, both talismans. I think I can now use these to uh, open the gate, probably. But before we do that, let's go up here. Wait, where was it? Here. Okay. Let's be careful about our um, lunacy. Anyways, I think I should be able to rock bridge myself up there. Right? Probably. Okay, the hidden area. What's in here? How much lunacy do we have? 71. Let's be careful. Bunch of life. A new soundtrack? Here? Let's be careful. Oh my. Um. That's deep water. I think our lunacy is too high for this place. Let's not be here. At least not yet. Okay. We know how to enter this area. So let's go back and save. And then let's enter this. Okay. Let's go back to our base. Okay, we are back here at the area. Arena. And we can probably level up. Oh, we got three levels? That's amazing. What should we level up? We have so much stuff. Okay, let's get that 50 defense. Let's get more resistance. Okay. Um, should we... Okay, Lunacy re resets every time you save. So, my guess is Lunacy is bad then. I mean, why would it reset every time I save? It has to be bad if it resets every time I save. Think about it. Okay, let's go back here then, and let's explore that water temple, or whatever that is. It looked like a water temple because it was surrounded by water. Ah oh, fuck, I forgot to jump. Shit.
Okay. A hidden temple of some sorts, eh? Okay, I think I'll die if I go into that water. So, let's parkour up here instead. There we go. What's all of this, then? It's beautiful, that's for sure. Um, can we enter somewhere? Also, is that water deadly or not? I'm not sure. This is where we came from. Oh no, we are in fact drowning. Wait, our character can swim? That's great! I didn't know our character can swim. It's actually really good. Let's take some breath. Okay. Oh, here's a entrance maybe? No. There seems to be a way up. So maybe somewhere around here there's a way up. Okay, great. We have some air in here. That's good. I didn't know we could swim in this game, but apparently we can. Which is great. Our character can, in fact, swim. Can we... Ah, of course. We cannot use our flame candle in the water. I will equip Blade of Ophelia. It's the most likely thing to be good. Oh, here's a chest. No mimic? Fractured death? What's this? Okay. It's not a weapon. Is it perhaps an item here? It should be an F. No. So it's a material. A pale translucent gemstone. A dense vapor is caught inside. Said to be the first water. The first water. Huh. Fascinating. So that's what this is about then, right? This water temple. Okay. I think I understand. The first source of water, eh? Interesting. Let's get some air before we continue. I don't actually know if we like actually need air, but it's good to make sure that we have air, right? I'm still surprised that we can swim in this game. I, I, I really didn't know, that's kind of strange that I didn't realize. Okay. Now the real question is, should we find out what lunacy does? Like, we could save and test what lunacy is doing. Like, what does it do? I'm, I'm really curious what lunacy will do. So, I wonder if the seal is broken now, since I have t two things. Seal. Yes. Amazing. The seal has been broken.
Anyways, uh, let's test out lunacy. What will happen at 100 lunacy? Oh yeah, I shouldn't... I should probably get a spell that I can spam easily. Could, um... Could Ignis Color be the one? Oh, Ignis... Color doesn't give it. I wonder if... Okay, um... What's a cool... What's a good low-cost spell? Okay, lowest I've seen was 10. Oh yeah, flame spear. I'm not gaining any fucking lunacy from that. I'm not gaining no lunacy from that. Huh. Why not? Barrier. Still at 6%. Well, this gives me a lot. I wonder if the spell type matters. Like, what if I? I think there's a uh, lunar magic in this game. Well, yeah, moon baby swan. That's a lunar magic. Blood drain is a. Uh, Okay, that gives one. Let's see. <laughs> How much does the light reveal? Give? Oh, just one. Let's just use the speed spell. It's giving 10 on each. It's taking a bit long though. This is probably kind of boring. I mean, this is boring me too. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't. I'm not really that interested in what it does, honestly. So... I started to wonder what's in the... What the... Uh, first tier thing. Like, what I can craft with it. But, um... I think I'll just wanna head here now. We can try crafting later. What's behind this door then? Chamber of Faith? Um... What? Okay. I have a slight feeling that that's, I mean, the name is Chamber of Faith. I have this slight feeling that that might be the final boss fight or something. I mean, the fucking name is <laughs> Chamber of Faith. And there's a speech. Last time we heard some real speech was in 
you know, the last boss fight. I wonder if I should go to the Labyrinth of Ash then. This is a place to explore as well. What time is it though? Okay. We have about uh, 15 minutes left, right? I wonder what I should do. Honestly, should I just <laughs> do the... Should I just start leveling up things again? Where's that? Uh, obsidian seal. Yeah, I wanna level this up and see what it gives. I think we're gonna do that. First, let's hit the wings first and see what we can craft. Hello Demi, do you have anything new? Nope. Nothing new. Hello, Etna. Yeah. What does the fractures, fractured death give me? Nothing. Okay. Getting nothing. That's great. Can I use uh, fiddleheads for anything now? No? Okay. Can't craft shit. Yeah, you told me. Cheryl, are you selling anything new? Yeah. You have nothing. Great. Bye bye. Okay. So, shall we return to the library to level up another object? That's like. How many times have we gone here to level up things? <laughs> Wait a minute. Where are the books immune to dark magic actually? Should I even level things up here then? Wait, let me check. Yeah, you're... You got that immunity. Ah, fuck. There's a lot of books on the ground, though, for leveling up. Do -do -do -do. I mean, this is like a prime level up area because there's so many books on the ground. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just use this to level up once again. I can't really think of a better, better place to level up, except perhaps the garden in the... The garden in that one area. The... what... what... what is it called? The... manor. The garden in the manor, that's a great area for leveling up as well, because I can just bonk bonk on the uh, garden and I can always reload the level and then harvest the garden again and gain resources, so that's pretty good leveling up spot as well, but I think this is better. While we're at this, we could level up the Lunacy. Actually, no. We shouldn't, because... If I die here... With a... Uh, if, if, if having high Lunacy kills me, then... Why would I... I, 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 w I would lose my levels. You know? I don't think that's good. Uh, break this light. We have made some good progress on the thing. Let's continue breaking shit so we can level this up. 
Okay. Okie dokie. Let's go down this elevator. There's some plants in this area that we can break. Poop. 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 Nice. Nice. <sighs> and some books. Okie dokie. There we go. <sighs> I'm getting a bit EP. EP, EP, sleepy, sleepy. Books. Let's keep it up. Let's level it up. Boop. 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 Pow. Some books here. Clean them up. Okay, holy shit, this is taking a long time to level up. I've almost cleared this floor and there's like... We're not even halfway there. Jeez. I'm starting to wonder if killing enemies grants a bit more levels. I should probably look into that. Uh, I should at least kill the milk snails downstairs, eh? Maybe I'll go to the manor, actually, and kill those uh, poltergeists and all, because they can be used for killing as well. And they do take dark damage, so this should be effective against them. But yeah, I can also break the sofa. Whoa. There we go. Sad. Rip sofa. Okay, let's jump down. Oop, I didn't land on the tree. Chew. Chew. Okay, let's kill these snails. Sorry, snail. Oop. Excuse me. Boom. Boop. <laughs> okay, yeah, I think I think killing enemies gives a bit more experience. I mean, that's what it feels like. Dragon punk. Where's that one snail? Here. Sorry, little pal. Later, buddy. We're getting like nowhere with this. We're not even halfway. Okay, we're almost halfway. That's great. I think the manor actually might be a better. Leveling up a place for this, since there's things that take dark magic in there. Yeah, uh, Deodalus just left. Wonder where he has gone. Let's break his little incense lamp. Sorry, snail. Let me aggro that so we don't get to fight with the other creature. 
Okay, we're halfway there now. Let's head up here. And, uh... <laughs> Let's head to the, uh... Lefanu Castle. Let's get that. Let's get that stuff. Hoopla. Okay, though. Can't level up. I haven't done enough. Let's head here and uh, kill those enemies. I think we can get much more levels in here by... Oh. I'm sorry. Please unencourage me. Phantom. Yeah, here we can uh, collect the woods from the stakes and all that stuff. Brown. Yeah, we can break wood for experience. Great. Boop, 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 boop. <sighs> wood collection. Yippee. <laughs> What's the time? Oh, great heavens. It's almost time to quit. Well, I'm finishing this job before I quit. That's for sure. I'm, I'll be I'll be doing this before I quit. Here's the great leveling spot where we can just collect the plants. Bling, 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 bling. Okay, great. Now, let's go be. Should we beat up the poltergeists or what? I think beating up the poltergeists is a good idea. That's one way to level this thing up. Now, would there be faster methods, I wonder? I cannot think of a better location. I'll just go here and deal with the poltergeists. Yeah, half heart? That's great. Oh, yeah, we seem to gain a lot of experience from it. Yeah, we, we seem to gain more experience from it. I'm not sure if it's just me being silly and saying things, but... I think, yeah, we, I think we do gain more from this. You probably get more experience for harder enemies. I mean, it would make sense, right? To gain more for a harder enemy. Uh, yeah, we're almost done. Uh, okay, there's nobody here. Do, do, do. What to do? Let's break the good old chair. Was there any more poltergeists here? Okay, there's a, there's a phantom again. Another phantom. And I think there's a vampire out here. Right? Oh, there's cursed paintings here. That's right. And they take... <sighs> I can't kill them with that, unfortunately. So, we're not getting any levels from them. Oops. Be careful of that. Okay, what should we do now? Since we got the things from the paintings? I think I should break the dinner table. I mean, that's one good way to 
finish things off. I think this will be quite fast because wait, is it already full? I think I'm seeing the color there. No, it's not. I'm just being stupid. I hope clearing this dinner dinner table will level it up fully. I should have maybe come here first before going to the book area. I mean, this is just much more efficient. Just clear this uh, dinner table and then reload the level, come back, clear the dinner, dinner table. You know, you know. It's really good. Okay, it's ready. I think, it, I think it's ready. I really want to clear this dinner, dinner table before leaving though. Nice and clear now, huh? Yeah. I think I might be a bit obsessed. Okay, now it's all empty. Great. Let's head back and level this thing up. Let's see what we shall gain from it. From this dark weapon. Maybe this will be an actual dark weapon this time, or maybe it will be something else. Who knows? We shall see. Let's warp back to the wing's rest. And level up this bad boy. Ah, you're playing the flute. Thank you. That's a beautiful beat. Saint Ish... What? Saint Ishi... A blade from de a dead world. A twisted seal wrapped around countless sacrifices. Does Split dark and fire damage. Oh my goodness. That's really good. Wow. That's amazing. Thank you, Moon, for bleeding for us. Anyways, do we have anything for this now? No, we don't. I guess we're gonna find it in the labyrinth then. Also, can I level up? I did not gain levels from that. How much did I gain? Oh, I'm actually almost leveled up. That's funny. Anyways, in the next episode, we will be heading to the labyrinth of ash. But we're not going not we're not going yet, because that's in the next episode. Anyways. I shall be ending this episode right here. Thank you everyone for watching. Bye bye.